Oops, I did it again. Uh, Chestnut, I don't know her. I, I, <laughs> she was beautiful. Okay, don't get me wrong. She was wonderful while she lasted. But she's just, she's not it anymore. I, I, I hate to say it. What I want to do now is I want to start a spring island. And I know this is, this is basically me regurgitating what I said when I started Chestnut. But this time I'm for real. I'm for real this time. What if this like turned into like a pirated warning? <laughs> you just see Tommy pull out a gun. I don't really remember. Oh my god, someone please give her brown contacts. I'm literally shaking right now. Oh my god. All right. Nope. Immediately no. Immediately no. Oh god, this is gonna take forever. I'm already annoyed. So honestly, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna do all of this off camera because if I don't, when I go to edit this, I'm gonna hate myself. So I will be back. After way too long of doing this, I finally decided that I was going to try this island out. And while we flew in, I saw apples and I was really excited because I think apple trees are super cute. I think they make for great decoration. Like, you know, just like a little apple tree. So I was kind of hopeful, I was feeling great. And then this happened. I'm fine with goose. I don't like Goose, but that's part of the fun, is having an enemy. But then there's Renee. And I was not about to have Renee on my island. Like, I'm sorry, maybe I'm a hater, but it was an absolute no for me. Then literally 25 minutes later, 25 minutes of doing this, I found another one. You know, peaches. Peaches are a super springy fruit. So I was fine with that. I've had peaches before, but it's fine. No big deal. Um, I also did change the time to be in springtime. And then, once again, horrible villagers. Don't get me wrong, I love Antonio. Antonio, I think, is so cute, but I would not willingly have him on my island. Not not as a starter. And so I... I really, looking back on this island, like, I have a green airport, too. That's so cute. But I had to... I had to give it up. I had to give it up. This clip was an hour later. I don't remember if I took a break or not. I think I did. But... Yeah, an hour later. This was at 4 a.m. Peaches. Fine, that's fine with me. You know, this time around I don't really care about the fruit because you can get all of the fruits if you want. So, this was not the problem. This was the problem. The villagers. Like, Antonio, I have said many times that I love you, but in this moment, love was the last thing I was feeling for this ant eater. So, uh, you know, I did what came naturally, and I, um, blew the island up. I, I mean, I closed my switch, I, I, um, uh, so since it was 4 a.m., um, after that last island, I came back the next day and started the routine over again. And when I tell you that I have never closed my game faster than when I saw these starter villagers, it was- I, I truly think, like, my fight-or-flight instincts kicked in. Because what is this? Is this a joke? Is- <laughs> I didn't waste a single second. I did not waste a single second getting out of there because I did not feel safe. But after probably a total of two hours of doing this, because it took me two separate nights, finally, it happened. Not only did I get, you know, a decent map design, I mean, I picked it after all, but I also got someone very special to me on this island. There's no way. There's no way. <laughs> the way that I was literally sitting here waiting for it to load, like what if Hazel's here? There's no way. And bam, Hazel and bam. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. 
Oh my god. I can't. I can't. Look at her. Look at her. I can't believe it still. Like, this is so. What? What? And then once night fell, we did what we always do. And we figured out a name for the island. And I chose Asteria. I don't even know if that's how you say that word. But. As corny as it is, because my name is already Aster, I wanted to make like a purple island, like the Aster flower. Uh, but it's okay, because even though it's corny, everyone was literally obsessed with it. Like, look at that. Look at it. Of course, of course it would win. And then after partying my ass off, I went to sleep and drummed about my uh, my crush, KK Slider. What? Who said that? Guys, there's a ghost in my room. Anyways. Then, Tom Nook uh, told me that I was in crippling debt, which is always a wonderful thing to find out first thing in the morning. Love him. So, I did, you know, little things like this just to get my miles up. Look at me go. This it, Honestly, it didn't- I got like 2,000 miles maybe, but... <laughs> it, it, it's, it's the thought that counts. Look, yeah, I'm a new leaf papa. Then I talked to Bam and he gave me... A really nice hat actually i thought it was gonna be ugly uh, maybe i have no faith in him but it was actually it's really cute look how cute bam did such a great job and then i talked to my best friend hazel <laughs> and it was amazing and i missed her so much and i love her i love her to death welcome back um we're officially on day two yeah i just skipped the rest of day one because it's not very exciting i mean I just went around and like shook some shook some trees, I bought some items, all that fun stuff. I have a lawn chair now, which is exciting. Honestly, she's right. Like, why do we need money to live on a deserted island, Tom Nook, you sick freak? God. I know we have to give stuff to Tom Nook for blathers to come. Oh, there's a money spot. I don't even have a shovel. My god. Um, I know we have to give stuff to Tom Nook so blathers will come, but my- plan is to keep blathers in his tent uh, uh, i've never done that before and it's like why do i need a museum i don't really want a museum i don't i've never like okay the museum is fine it's fun and i know like you can get um get, like rooster to come but like i don't really want to do all that i don't i'm just not i'm just not i i i did the museum the first time on my first island i think that's enough that's enough museum for me and I made a little like mood board. <laughs> I made like a little, a little inspiration board, I guess you would call it, um, for what I want this island to look like. Good news. Oh, we can do group stretching now. Oh boy. Um, I'm actually gonna do that because I still haven't paid my first house loan, or I guess my tent loan. I'm probably gonna do a goofy little, a silly little group stretching for the miles, and then never do it again. Throw that shit back in. Oh, or drop. <laughs> I didn't even realize. Oh my god, it's a yellow airport. That's so cute. That's actually adorable. I didn't even realize- I like completely forgot that your airport can be different colors. That's crazy. He just hung up on him. He hung up on her! Shit. Ooh. Wait, this is scary because um, I don't think you can move his tent. Oh god. Oh, I didn't think about this. Oh, he remembered. He's so sweet. Are you kidding me, dude? Uh, help! Am I crazy, or is it the sisterly villagers that like help you out when you get stung? She's gonna start screaming. She's so caring. Did you get stung by a wasp? Does it hurt? You okay? Yeah. See, she knows. She knows what's up. She's so kind. This is so. <laughs> This is so scary. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ay, 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 ay. 
The way the way the character counts is so adorable. Oh, I'm a little behind. Oh my god, everyone's ahead of me. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> God. Uh. Well, you know what they say. Um. Uh. I don't say good morning. I just say morning. Cause if it was a good morning, I'd be fishing. <laughs> I'd be fishing. <laughs> Most of this I'm probably gonna do like away and like not record it because um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a lot more comfortable to, you know, just play the game for fun when I'm not sitting at my computer because let's be honest, it's not very comfortable here. I would rather play this game in my bed, but I do want to show you guys um, my, my, my vision, my RDs for this, uh, 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 oh, oh my god, wait, can I actually present it? Wait. <laughs> <gasps> Whoa! Oh, shh, go back. Okay, so this here is our island, of course. Here's the light bulb. That represents, um, definitely not my ideas because I'm stupid. So, here are the villagers I want. <laughs> Aren't they all so funny? <laughs> Sorry. Um, Hazel's staying, obviously. Um, but yeah, here, this would be if I could get all of these people. Not all of them, because there's too many. But if I can have an island full of these people, plus Hazel, I would be so happy. I especially want. Um. Um. I forgot her name. <laughs> because she would fit in so well. I also really want Judy. I've never really wanted Judy. I mean, I think she's she's a very beautiful girl. Don't get me wrong. But she would be so perfect here. Also, Diana. I had Diana on my last island. And I was like, mm, maybe I should, like, make a list of villagers I've never had before. But Diana would be so perfect here. She would be so perfect. All of these people, honestly, would be really perfect. The only one that, like, doesn't completely fit the theme, I guess, is Poppy. But I just want Poppy because she's so cute. All right, and then I put some like general inspiration as to what I want this island to look like. I have never done anything like this before and it's probably gonna be so hard, but I don't care because it's so pretty. Will I actually be able to do anything like this? Absolutely not because I'm stupid, but this is like what I'm going for. I want clutter, I want sparkles everywhere, I want paths everywhere, I want just a random tree stump like that. Like that's beautiful, that's perfect, it's amazing. But this is also just some like general inspiration as like certain areas i want like what i want them to look like yeah just some very very um uh cottage core um and then i want to make a little vineyard isn't that how you say isn't that <laughs> isn't it vineyard it's not vineyard isn't it it's vineyard um because i thought it would be cute to have like a little a little um grape grape grapes i have a little uh little vineyard purple because it's purple purple come on purple um and oh okay well this is a bit much but yeah i feel like the thing i struggle with the most is setting up a neighborhood having all the houses everywhere it freaks me out it freaks me out and i don't know what to do so i think i'm just gonna relax on this for a bit um, and then, yeah, my little camp, little campsite, a little, a little area for blathers, but I do need to figure out how to keep his tent, or like what to do with his tent now that I have it, like do I just not put it down, do, uh, we'll figure, we'll, I'll figure it out, I will figure it out. That is it for this video, I do kind of want to make like, make this be like a regular series, wouldn't that be good, wouldn't that be so creator core of me <laughs> content creator core of me oh my god but yeah that is the goal i really i want to get back into this game 
I know everyone who plays Animal Crossing says that at least once a year. Um, maybe you've said it once in your life, depending on when you started playing the game. But yeah, that's the goal. 